Yeah, you want it. L O B S T E R. Yeah, Ned got it. L O B S T E R. From Maine to Rhode Island, New Hampshire to Vermont, Mass to Connecticut, and New Jersey to Tut. Like Bermuda. Hi everyone. I hope winter break has treated you all well and college applications went smoothly for our seniors. Since one of my biggest duties as district treasurer is taking care of dues, I want to notify you all that the official deadline for dues is approaching fast. In the upcoming weeks, please work to collect and submit your membership dues to Key Club International by February 1st. Recently, I've received more and more questions about the dues submission process. First, head to our district website, newenglandkeyclub.org, and click on the dues header, which will give you an option to go to the membership update center. On this website, you will be able to update your membership roster and be able to pay online with a credit card or debit card. You can also print out an invoice and mail a check to Key Club International. Good luck with collecting. Coming to the second to last secretary report of the year, the next secretary report will be due on February 10th. Please remember to turn them in on time and before 11:59 on the 10th, so that I don't dock you a point for being late. Keep up the great work, and as always, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. To any club presidents watching, I would highly encourage you to consider applying for the Outstanding Presidents Award. The form can be found for this on the district website under the Contest and Scholarship section. And this is just a really great way for the district to honor the hard work you've done this year in your position. Keep on plowing closer and closer. The Outstanding Secretary Awards will also be released soon. These awards are typically given to those that not only meet but also exceed their expectations. This year, I know that many secretaries have had the difficulties of COVID-19 put on them, and I will take that into consideration when selecting the recipients. If you think that you did outstanding even during the time of the pandemic, I highly encourage you to submit an application for the Outstanding Secretary Award. Thank you. One great way to commemorate a general member's hard work this Key Club year is to apply for the Outstanding General Member Award. If you are a general member or know of a general member who deserves high praise for the work they have done this year, start compiling some accomplishments to submit. More information on this award will be released in February. Keep your eyes peeled. Hi, New England and Bermuda Key Clubbers. Have you checked out the Winter Yankee yet? This edition has just been released on the district website, so be sure to go check it out. It includes exciting articles from your district board, other branches of the K family, and general members. Go check it out! One tip that I would like to give all of the key clubs in the district is get creative with the service projects that you are offering to your members. For my key club, we decided to run more food drives and clothing drives than usual for the local families in need. We also had treat bags for our elementary school kids during the Halloween time to celebrate Halloween for them while staying COVID safe. We also plan on doing the same thing for our Valentine's Day. If you have any other suggestions, please feel free to let us know, and we will be sure to highlight you. Hey, what's cracking, NEVD? It's your membership development and education committee chair Hannah Nado here with another update. With the start of the new year, the membership development and education committee has been mainly focusing on developing decon and making it the most fun and fresh it possibly can be. We've been working a lot with the decon committee to make workshops nice and fun for you guys, and to have a schedule that's going to work for everyone. Last year there were some complications with this, so this year we are working to make everything perfect have a successful virtual decon. One of our main projects that we're doing in the Membership Development Education Committee is we're creating a workshop proposal form and we had sent it out to everyone in the district so all you guys should have been able to look at it, submit your ideas for a workshop proposal. I have kind of skimmed through a few of them and they sound awesome so far. So if you haven't already and it isn't past the deadline, go ahead and I suggest you submit a proposal for this because we are always looking for nice workshop ideas that could be cool and new. So until next time, see ya. <laughs> One tip that I have for key clubs during this often slow time is for officers to communicate with underclassmen about their positions. 
See what different members' strengths are and how they can contribute to your key club. This is a great way to prepare for a strong incoming board of officers. Specifics on key club officer duties can be found on our district website. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Susan Sunarajan, Lieutenant Governor of Division 24 of Western Massachusetts. And one of the most exciting parts about being an LTG is working with like-minded people across the division, our state, and our district to work together on different projects and bring new ideas to life. It's imperative that we work together as a community in the pandemic and hardships to be able to come together and work on new projects that can help everybody. And I'm glad to say that this has been happening and it's really exciting to see all this different progress going on, even in this year. Hi, my name is Alina Jacob and I'm the Lieutenant Governor for Division 30. Some of the duties a Lieutenant Governor has to cover are things like newsletters and monthly reports, which are due at the 10th of every month. This April, our current district board is going to be retiring and we're going to need 20 new Lieutenant Governors to fill their positions. If you think you might be interested in running for Lieutenant Governor, I would highly encourage you to talk to your Lieutenant Governor or any district board member because there are so many opportunities for you to gain leadership experience, get immersed in community service, and meet people from all across New England, Bermuda, and the United States. So please talk to us. We would love to see what this leadership position could look like for you. Hey, New England and Bermuda Key Clubbers. Are you looking for your next leadership role? As the immediate past Lieutenant Governor of Division 6, I encourage you to consider becoming your division's next Lieutenant Governor. It is a role that comes with a lot of responsibility, but it manages to teach you time management, organization, and communication. Through this role, you'll become really close with other members of the district. You might just meet your best friend. Good luck!